Hello everyone, I am Torio and welcome back to Let's Play Europa Universalis 4 with the Cradle of Civilization expansion as the Mumluks. Um, we have beaten up the Ottomans again, uh, but I'm currently waiting for Gazi Kumuk to accept our peace offer. Well, I'm not sure if peace is the most accurate. Oh, Mumluk succession. We need to subject. What? Okay, so we can get an Egyptian Mamluk with a strong claim, and then he can use the fun things, or we can get a Circassian guy with a strong, stronger claim, stronger -er claim. We have all the negative modifiers, though. We have all the negative mm, legitimacy modifiers. Do I really need those special things? What will that give me? That would give me money. And that would give me manpower. I have both of these things. You know what, I'll go with the Circassian guy. 532, not great, serviceable, acceptable. And we can um, denounce sect practices. Good, do that. More legalism. All the legalism. All yeah, right. He's a bit better than the previous guy. At least we don't lose stability uh, in succession as the mo Oh, he's cruel crap. Let's have him killed. Uh, do we have a free army? It's currently going to fight someone. You. He's a good general, though. He's a very good general. Alright, can we sign a peace deal here? Nope. We cannot. We should have taken the Egyptian guy. Next time I'll take the Egyptian guy. The Sheikh who is Lamb. Uh, yeah, I do like going towards legalism. All right. How about now, Gazikumuk? Are you ready to surrender your freedom yet? Nope. I'm patient. I can wait. Don't even need to fight anyone. In the meantime, convert provinces. Oh, right. When did my missionary strength go down? Yeah, Hungary has rivaled me. This is interesting. They're eyed with Austria. Austria can't break our alliance. Austria cannot break our alliance because we are in a war together. Is it possible that they will break uh, their alliance with Hungary if I prolong this war to, you know, make them stay? Ming has entered the golden era. Oh, also I have stockpiled tons of political power. Well, political power, admin and military power points, of course. Come on, Kazikumuk. Bloody hell. Not just yet. Oh, we lost a general. We have a lot of military power, we'll just hire another one. Yay, they'll accept. Give me all your money, too. That goes to Crimea, of course. And now, what do we want from the Ottomans? I might want to prolong this war a little bit, but what I want is all of Thrace. So it's Eden and Burgess. That's once. I want to connect my territories. I want Hutvendiga because it's a trade center. I want. Um, is it, Yeah, Sugla is a trade center. Anything else as a center of trade here? Yes, this place here. And it also belongs to the Ottoman. No, it belongs to Venice. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Almost did the wrong thing. I'd like to take Rhodes. Can I take Rhodes? No, because I don't control the fort. We'll get that later. Okay. How about this area here? No centers of trade. Okay. I suppose I'd like to take... That's a bit too much, apparently. Well, I don't really need Sugla, and I don't really need Karasi. It would look better if I took these instead. Titan can't take all of them either. I think I want to take Plovdiv so we can border Hungary more. I think I want to take Karasi. And I want to take the center of trade, even though it will not be connected to our territory. That gives us exactly 100% of extension, which is perfect. 
Which is perfect. I think I should I should send that peace deal. Although before we do that, Hudvendigar, what is the state here? Hudvendigar, Karasi, and Kosaili. Okay, we'll have the three of those. And Sugla is an another one that we would like to take as a state. Mentes, Saruhan, Aidin. I suppose I could just take these. I don't need to take Eden necessarily. No matter, I'll take all of it eventually. Don't need to hurry. Okay, so we take these, right? And money. We'll take all that power to core. Well, good thing is, we have all that power. Okay. No mission selected. Convert to Sunni, remove Luristan, protect brethren in Ardalan. Uh, I'll do one of those probably, but first... Coring. Do I have a way to reduce coring cost? Perhaps a scholar? No, that's just admin tech cost. Alright then, let's core what we have. Perfect. And let's make this a state. Ah, we can't yet. Can't yet. Should I keep the should I keep the force here? Well not in Tsukla, I don't need that one. We're rich enough to keep them, and they will strengthen our position against any Europeans. So I suppose I should keep them, and perhaps even station my fleet here, forever. I'll just repair it for now. This way it will be safe, forever. Is that the Gazikumukami? Looks like it. We'll have to deal, it and deal with it eventually. For now I should regroup my troops. Let's get all my troops into Constantinople. Because it should have sufficient support. Um, transport? Okay, let's do automatic transport. Oh, right, I got trapped here. That's fine. Lower army maintenance. Do I need to increase autonomy? Do I or do I not need to increase autonomy? Eden. No, I don't think I do. We'll be okay. And the Amirs want more territory. I will give you more territory, but first... Okay, uh, can I give it to you yet? Yes, I can, even though it's not a core. Eden. Eden is the wrong religion. I want to give it to the Dimi, because I want to make the Dimi a uh, large, important part of our country. Not sure if that is the best choice, but I think having sufficient influence of the Dimi is good. Mm, Burgess. Burgess, Burgess. Also Dimi. It'll bring their influence to 29.3. That's still not much. Still not much. Zimi's influence is 29. I need to get it to how much? 40? I mean, eventually it will get there. Right. Mm, what else? Uh, can I make more states? I can make two more states. So this will be one, and I suppose this should be the other, but I don't need to rush this. Uh, let's go back to states and territories map mode. Okay, okay, now let's go back to the ledger for a moment. Sold by development again. Hudvendigar, yeah, I'm gonna make that a, terri uh, a state. Karadeniz. Uh, Karadenis, which one is that? Is that here? Yes. And most of them are already cores. Like full cores. So that is a good that's a good uh, candidate. Alright, yeah, anything else? Well, I could take military tech, but that would give me corruption. Then again, if I am to fight Hungary or someone like that, I will need to. Um I need another general. He's good. All right, let's get our troops together. And move both of the forts. And hopefully have Hungary and Austria break their alliance. Ottomans are no longer a valid rival. You don't say. Can I have one of my subjects deal with those rebels? Really don't want to deal with them. Oh, oh. 
Devacy, are you in trouble? I'll need to send some guys there, but let's regroup our armies first. Also, Fazan has been under annexation forever, and it is still under annexation. I think it's time to attack Tlemkin. We do have Fazan's claims, but we can just take the land for ourselves. Gezikung Separatists. Alright, they'll probably move to Crimea. I will have to send one of the armies there. What's going on? Why is the army... Why is the fleet not... Okay, something is wrong here. You, mission. Protect trade in Alexandria. That's your mission. This fleet will bring those troops where they're supposed to go. Let's split you. Get you over here. And split you properly. Alright, uh, what was my setup? It was four cannons, six cavalry, and fifteen infantry. No, not the perfect setup, but I found it elegant. Now let's uh, redo that a bit. Uh, one more cavalry to this one. No, I did something wrong. I think I transferred the cannon instead. Okay, there's another complete one. Go here. Actually, you can just go and deal with the rebels for us. Let's go kill the rebels. They're going towards Gazikumak, aren't they? Hmm, they might just get killed on the way. And you are going... Where are you going? I'm just going to ignore them for now. Okay, then. Hungary has rivaled me, so I will have to fight them. So we don't need to do that immediately. No, no automatic transport. Just manual. I have to build some more transport ships. So I will have to be... Oh! Again, I forgot to give them land. So. Constantinople stays with me. This is nobody's. Let's give it to the Amir. No, let's give it to the Ulema. They still want more? The Amirs do. Uh, this doesn't have. This has all the manpower. Here you go. It should be sufficient for your needs. Perfect. Uh, can I exploit you yet? I want to exploit the merchants, but it's a bit early for that. Also, they don't have enough control over territories for this to work properly. Right. Split you in half. 16 and 17. Oh, I have too many infantry. Something weird happened. 15. 16, 4, 4. 6, 17, 4, 4. 15, 6, 4. 15, 6, 4. Did I get some troops wiped and then... Get some infantry I didn't order. Maybe I did order it. Ah, whatever. This is a good setup, it's fine. Let's assign some leaders to the armies. Okay, good. Missions. Remove Luristan from the map or attack Ardalan. Ardalan is down here somewhere, isn't it? Let's see. Oh, it's here. Yeah, I suppose I could attack Karaku, you know, but I really don't feel the need. There are so many better targets. I feel like Tlemkin should be our next target. So we can snag North Africa. Before anything else happens. Also, I should finish off Tunis. Uh, what else? Well, I do need to fight Ajuran again. Mm, we still have a truce, though. How about Mushasha? Yeah, I could attack those. But I do have claims on Tlemkin, so this will be an instant war. Let's just go that way. Keep them at low maintenance for now. Let's get some money back. And probably get some buildings. It's gonna pay off more than drilling people. Let's get some mosques. 
All right. And perhaps some workshops. Well, this one was profitable. How about some uh, trade buildings? That will do for now. Okay, our guys are on the way. Austria is still maintaining the alliance, but there is a danger in that. There is a danger in that. Uh, I do have to improve relations just to make sure that the alliance stays. I can always use my numerous favors to increase trust if it's in danger. Because I have tons of allies and I haven't used them much, which means I have tons of trust. Just sitting there in my account. Crimea got rebels. What a surprise. Yeah, Crimea is not a good subject. I probably should have, shouldn't have taken them from the Ottomans. Still, they let me expand here a bit. Karkun... Oh, and happiness among the peasantry. We could gain prestige for stability. We could lose money. Or we could get some peasants in Bahiria. What's that? Here. You know what, I'm gonna do that one, but first let's increase army maintenance. I mean, it's not a large peasant force, but why lose people if you don't have to lose people, right? Also, we're spending a lot of money to root out corruption. Which is perhaps a mistake, because it'll go down naturally. Yeah, let's stop that. It's gonna decrease on its own. Okay. You ready? Let's wait until next month and go. That's better. Alright, you guys going here, so I still need to send you to uh, Biskra. Reducing maintenance again. Okay. Dongola. Ardalan and where's Luristan again? I think it was somewhere here. Luristan. Is that it? Yes. Oh, it's Baluchistan and independence guaranteed by Mushasha. They're not a threat to me. But I have I have higher priorities. I wanna annex Yemen soon. I wanna annex Yemen and I wanna finish annexing Ajuran and move down south. This is a this is a higher priority for me. For now let's just do Tlemkin, because we haven't done anything in that part of the world for a long time. Screw Baba traditions. No. No? What? When the hell did that happen? Crap. Damn it. I broke the alliance or they broke the alliance? Bloody hell. We didn't get a message that's breaking. I hate it when this happens. Well, we'll have, we'll have Spain and Austria on our side if they decide to fight us, but... Ah, damn it. Enemies. Hungary, Muscovy and Ming. I have France as a rival. I suppose I could change that. Do I want to be friends? No. Do you want to be friends? Perhaps. Although, is it worth it? I'm not sure. Denmark, do you still have your unions? Yes, you do. Would you like to be friends? You hate Muscovy? You might. Damn it, Muscovy. I invested so much in this alliance. <sighs> Damn it. We'll manage, but still, this is disappointing. Makes me angry. Very, very angry. At Muscovy, of course. Right, right. We have. Let's not worry about that. We have people to. We have people to conquer. Tlemkin, you wouldn't accept vassalization, would you? No. Oh, you would if you didn't have more than hundred development. I mean, I have enough vassals, but that would save me a war. How about Mushasha? Well, you hate me, so you wouldn't. Tlemkin would could make a good vassal, perhaps. Well, probably not. Let's increase army maintenance. Wait a minute, what's that? Huh. Feudal theocracy. Let's get our guys ready and attack them. Once the morale is full. 
Too few rivals. Yeah, I know. Russia has formed. Yes, now they form. <sighs> Damn it. Can I make you unrival me somehow? Improve relations? I don't know. I don't want to fight Russia. Could you rival Hungary? I'm gonna rival Hungary. At least France doesn't hate me anymore. Okay, this has been a disappointing turn of events. I have been investing in this alliance with Russia for a very long time, and I got nothing out of it. Alright, do I want a discipline guy for 11? No, I want a morale guy for 1. Paying for diplorep is enough. Paying for diplorep is enough. Can I make this a state yet? Yes, I can. Kasim something something. Gain admin power or gain prestige. Oh, right, that's one of the stability events. Admin power, please. Let's make this into a state. Core everything. How many more states can I make? One. It was supposed to be something up north here, wasn't it? Yes, this. Or Sugla, possibly. Because it will be having all these provinces and they're good too. Hmm. I should probably take this because I'll forget otherwise. I mean, we'll eventually do Tunis, but I've been waiting for so long that it's not... You know, I shouldn't be waiting anymore. No, you know what? By the time we take these, we'll probably have the option to get more states from the next level of technology. So let's just take the one that is going to be profitable to us. And core everything. You demand control of provinces, really? You do. Well, actually, I would like to give this to the merchant class. I want them to have a little bit more influence. How about this? This will be very good for the Amirs, because it has a lot of manpower. Koseli, do I want to give it to someone? Oh, I suppose I can just give it to the Ulema, because I have to give them something. How about these new provinces? Well, they're all the proper religion, so I can't really benefit from them that much uh, by, you know, giving them to the Dimi. Well, so we've lost our alliances. Bummer. Uh, can I invest my military power in a productive way? Can I invest my military power in a productive way? I could hire another general, just so it doesn't go to waste. Let's attack. Then I can do war taxes or something. Actually... Corruption will be going down soon. Once I'm no longer overextended. But perhaps it would be fine to have the technology gap and stuff. Nah, I'm talking, I'm talking bollocks. Okay. Mm. Okay, so, I can't get the Demi to have enough influence to give me stuff. Merchants will regain their influence in two years. Good. Ulema. We don't want you. You. Give me a diplomat. That'll give them some influence. Will that be a problem? No, they'll go up to 78, which is still manageable. Good. Mm. Merchants, I should probably make use of something. Their loyalty will go down, but um, it's some money. Sure. Okay, let's hire the guy. This is the diplomat level 3 for 5 only. And we really need diplomat power, so I'm going to promote this guy. Okay, the cost went up by a lot. I wonder if that gives us access to any new events or something. So if I do this again, he'll cost 20 or something. Hmm. Well, I suppose I could do it to him. It's not that expensive. Alright, let's attack. I need that diplomat from Russia. I'm very disappointed. I've been their ally for many, many years. We had tons of trust. And now, right out of the blue, boom. I'm angry. 
Uh, do I want to call in Morocco as co-belligerent and do I want to call in Spain at all? I don't feel like I need to call in Spain. They would call in Songhai. I'm fine with them calling in Songhai. All right, let's call them in as co-belligerent. Do I want to call in Spain though? They would help, but I don't need that help. Unfortunately, we'll lose some legalism, but it's a fluid uh, medium, you know. Let's move in. Also, it is now time to end the episode. Is this progressing at all? 69? Oh, that's not worth it. Screw that. I don't want to pay for the missionaries for that long. And we are the defender of the faith. Hmm. Okay, that's, I suppose that's okay. Anything else? Military tech would be helpful. Would be very helpful. Maybe I should take it. Let's, let's at least wait until next year so we don't waste too much political... Too much monarch points. Too many monarch points. And then... All that diplo power that we need. Going to waste. Right, I suppose to end the episode, wasn't I? <laughs> I'll see you soon. Goodbye.